What's going on, viewers? Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, continuing on with my epic amount of Grand Theft Auto San Andreas videos. This is the second video where CJ deals with the Mountain Cloud Boys, which is the Chinese Tong that Wu Mu is in charge of. In this video, CJ is being used to um, get a car for another Chinese leader. And, well, he ends up in an ambush. So let's get on with this walkthrough video. Hey, Woozy, my man. What's going down? Hey, CJ. Let me introduce you to Shuk Fu, Ram Fa Li. He heads the Red Gecko Tong on the West Coast. How you doing? Yeah. Mm. Mm. Ah Ah Kong has sent word from Kowloon. A Vietnamese crime family, the Da Nang Boys, are preparing to move to the United States. This may explain the cowardly attack on the Blood Feather Triad. Mm. There may be some trouble ahead. The Shifu would like a package retrieved. A courier has left it in a drop at the airport. It is most important to the matter at hand. Oh, I can do that. <laughs> he is Triad? A mountain boy? No, a personal friend of mine. And less likely to draw the attention of the Danang boys. Okay. <laughs> Thanks for your support. So CJ has to drive to the airport and pick up a car and deliver it to a warehouse for another... Chinese leader, gang leader, and real simple, right? I mean, come on. Then again, it's not going to be that simple. I'm going to cut over to where CJ finds the car. Once uh, CJ is at the airport, you drive through the tunnel here, and watch cars disappear and over to the side is where the car is parked and it's over in one of these areas here uh, you can see it over to the right and just park the vehicle you brought anywhere and make sure CJ is armed with the AK or well the AK just make sure CJ is armed with the AK because that is going to help out. Now once CJ gets into the car and yeah, he's going to be need to be need to be armed, but he finds out that hey, guess what? It's an ambush. The Danang boys are covering the exits. Take the car back to the garage. Well, they try and pull you out just drive over and around to the exit into the next parking area. And the Danang boys are going to block off this exit. Get out of the car and shoot the guy so that he can't attack you. And then just drive through the truck here and drive down to the far end here take a left and the Danang boys can't really block you because you just go up this exit area and you can get to just run this guy over and then stop well you don't even have to stop just drive up on the sidewalk and hit this guy you're going to take minimal damage the idea is to take minimal damage but get the car there in you know 
it doesn't matter as long as the car gets there and you can park it. Now, don't try and go cross country. They're going to send guys after you. Just go this road all the way up to the warehouse. And the Da Nang boys are going to continue to pursue CJ. And if you want, you can get out of your car and just gun these clowns down with the AK. They're going to shoot at you, but gun them down and gun down a few civilians. Yeah, whatever. But just stay on this road because you've pretty much gotten rid of your pursuers. And the more you try to, yeah, get this guy down, he's unarmed, but he's one of your pursuers. Now get back in the car and drive to the warehouse because there will be very few pursuers. I'm going to fast forward through because it's kind of a boring journey, but just stay on this low road. Now you see the Da Nang boys send a pickup truck, but you can easily get past that and park your car in the red spot the wanted level drops off and you have succeeded six thousand dollars plus respect now cj will have enough money to be able to now purchase zero's store to start the zero missions and i will do a video on that later i'm probably going to jump to the next video that will be um, the, uh, guy who is after Jizzy, when you go to Jizzy's club and meet T-Bone Menendez and have to do a mission for him. As always, don't forget to subscribe, smash the like button, smash the dislike button, but hey, just subscribe because cost you nothing and if you do like these type of videos keep coming back i'm brad proprietor of barstool entertainment thanks for stopping by enjoy your meal sir Thank mm -hmm. you.